hey guys welcome back to our channel so glad you guys are here with us uh, so today we're getting a COVID test no we're not uh, sick or nothing like that it's just that um, this guy right here is gonna need a COVID test because he goes to the dentist tomorrow at CHLA and that's one of the requirements and um, we have to get it done and hopefully we get the results today because if we don't get it today he might not be able to see the doctor tomorrow and that sucks because that means he's gonna have to retest whenever I could get a appointment for him so yeah we're all here at uh, the other children hospital here in Loma Linda this one is in San Bernardino, but it's so different from the CHLA. Like here, we see when he gets sick or we need to do a, um, a physical, we see different doctors. Cause this is like a college, you guys. Like uh, students, uh, doctors are like graduating and um, yeah, and they come here and they finish something like that. But there are students in here too as doctors so we see like four to three doctors every time and it's like a long day if you come here for an appointment but today we're um doing this covid test for him say hi brandon hi. good job yeah are you gonna go get tested you hung okay when we get out of here, Brenda, you're gonna get food, okay? But guess what? You're gonna have to do a COVID test. And that's no fun. It sucks, I feel so bad for him because he doesn't know what's going on and you guys pray for us. Um, it's gonna be a struggle. I hope we're able to get something. If not, I'm gonna have to call CHLA and cancel until further, further uh, notice i guess uh about brandon because again as you guys know some autistic kids do not like to be touched or doesn't do not like certain items in their face and that's brandon and let me tell you something he is a strong kid i think because i have been around autistic kids and uh they're very strong you guys not only are they smart but they're super duper smart uh strong and Brandon, he turned eight and his strength is getting stronger as he gets older. So I'm pretty nervous to see how this goes. Um, they start testing at four, so we got like three minutes and uh, we're gonna see how it goes. Um, I'm not happy, tomorrow's gonna be the same thing. He hates the dentist, you guys. Uh, I don't know if he's gonna be able to be uh, get a cleaning and everything uh, he did get before um, dentist treatment and he was put to sleep like on like a sleep asleep and it was super scary and so I don't know if he's able able to do anything for him tomorrow if they can't do what they need to do with him most likely they will put him to sleep or they will give him strong medication where uh, he's more relaxed and he's not fighting us and the dentist could do what he has to do but it's super hard you guys um it sucks i mean it sucks when your kiddos are in the spectrum sometimes because you know you're trying to help them but they don't really uh, they don't really think that's what's happening they're just afraid of what's being uh in their face or what's being brought in in front of them and it is scary i get it it is scary i think every uh kid is scared of the, of the dentist i mean it's not just kid with autism or any kind of other disability i think it's every type of kid that is afraid of the dentist but i like try to tell brandon i always uh keep him updated like i always tell him brandon you're gonna see the dentist brandon you're gonna see the doctor uh, so I always always um, keep them ready but it still doesn't help um, it's hard you guys but uh, yeah we'll see how this goes um, 
I'm hoping we get at least something for tonight so tomorrow he could be seen because it's just not fair doing this over and over again and again like i said it's not his fault it's not like it's uh something that he doesn't want to do it's you know the way he is he doesn't like certain things uh he's afraid and again it's like i guess it's every typical kid i know i was afraid of the doctor i of the dentist i hated the dentist but you know uh, Brandon is just different. Every kid that's in the spectrum, we are, they're all different in their own ways. I mean, some kids could do this, some kids can't. Some kids don't mind being touched or being uh, seen the dentist. Some kids do, and that's my son. So, I mean, it's hard, you guys, but we gotta work on the on them, and it's gonna be good. But you guys, I wanna thank everybody that's subscribing. And no, it's still not a big number, you guys, but hey. Our page is growing, our our channel's growing. Brandon, Brandon, he's busy, guys. Uh, he turned eight yesterday, and we had a fantastic, I couldn't vlog no more, nothing like that, because a lot of people here showed, not a lot, but uh, our group that we invited came, and it was just too much, you guys. And not everybody likes to be in the camera. So yeah, guys, I hope you guys stay blessed. I hope you guys stay safe. Remember, stand, stay brave stand strong and stand brave you guys and we'll see you guys soon remember to subscribe to our channel sorry you guys i kept being here subscribe to our channel and like our channel and share all of our stuff say bye brandon hey say bye do you need help do you need help you don't need help hey, hey no all right you guys this kid is over here struggling anyways we gotta go bye